the Pokemon card game in just nine minutes. I got my first pack of Pokemon cards. Thing is, I have no idea how to play the game. What did you say? You don't know how to play with your Pokemon cards. Huh? Uh, who are you? I'm Kay, a Pokemon card scientist. But you can call me Professor Pokecard like everyone else here. Professor Pokecard? Let's see. Now that's a pretty nice deck you've got there. Just you wait. I'll make you into a Pokemon card master in no time. What? The Pokemon trading card game lets you battle using your favorite Pokemon. And the fastest way to learn is just by playing. You can battle me and I will teach you everything. Uh, okay. You have a Sprigatito and Lucario EX deck. I will face you with my own Quaxley and Mimikyu EX deck. I won't lose! A deck is made up of 60 Pokemon cards, as you can see here. So that's what a deck is. After you finish shuffling your cards, place your deck here. Right! Start by greeting your opponent. Good, Good luck. luck! Have fun! Rock, paper, scissors, go! Yay! Looks like I won this part! Then you can choose to go first or second. And I'll go first! Now you see, the first step is to draw seven cards from your deck. Seven cards. That will be your hand. Wow! Do you have any Pokemon that say basic? Basic Pokemon. I have two! Place the first basic Pokemon you will battle with in the active spot. If you have any other basic Pokemon, place them face down on your bench. I'll put this Pokemon in the active spot. And this one on the bench. Next, take six cards from your deck and set them face down without looking at them. Put them in the space marked prize cards. Why do I have to lay six cards there? Every time you knock out an opponent's Pokemon, you take one of these cards as a prize, and then you can add it to your hand. Whoever takes all their prize cards first wins the game. Now I see. Let's go over the battle setup one more time. Okay, let's start the battle. Turn over the cards in the active spot and bench. Right! Sprigatito, I choose you! I'm going with Zangoose. Fine then, because I'm gonna win! First, you must draw one card from your deck. Yes, it's Riolu! Riolu is a basic Pokemon, so you can put it on the bench. Right! Oh look, you have energy cards! What's energy? During your turn, you can attach just one energy card from your hand to one of your Pokemon. If a Pokemon has the right amount and type of energy attached to it, it can use its attacks. Why don't you attach energy to the active Sprigatito? All right then. I will attach one grass energy card to my Sprigatito. So does that mean my Sprigatito can attack now? It is able to attack already. But when you go first, remember that you can't attack on the opening turn. That means your turn is over. Okay, I'm all done with my turn. Okay. I will start by drawing one card from my deck. I'll attach this psychic energy to Zangoose. This white mark means that any type of energy works for this attack. Now my Zangoose has all the energy it needs to attack. Oh. I will use the slash attack. That's 40 damage to Sprigatito. When your Pokemon takes damage, you place damage counters on it. This makes it easier to remember how much damage it's taken. Oh man, only 30 HP is left. I finished attacking, so now my turn is over. What do I do now? Hey, Ren. You have cards in your hand that say Trainer in the upper right. I have one Nimona and one Switch. There are many kinds of Trainer cards, such as Supporters or Items. They're all useful cards that can help you in battle. Why don't you try using one? OK, I'll play my Nimona Supporter card. But what does this do? I can draw three cards from my deck. Once you've used a card, put it in your discard pile. 
Important to know, only one supporter card can be used per turn. And remember, the player who goes first is not allowed to use a supporter card on their opening turn. Right. I'm not done yet. By the way, you can also attach energy to your bench Pokemon. In that case, I'll attach a fighting energy to Riolu. Now I'll use Sprigatito Scratch Attack. That's 10 damage to Zangoose. That's the spirit. I attacked, so it looks like my turn is over. Here I go. First, I'll evolve Quaxly to Quaxwell. By playing Pokemon on top of each other, they evolve and will keep getting even stronger. Next, I'll attach one Water Energy card to my Quaxwell. I'll also use my Nest Ball item card. This allows me to choose one basic Pokemon from my deck. By the way, you can use as many items from your hand as you like during your turn. The Pokemon I'll put into play is... Mimikyu EX. It looks powerful. Professor, what does the EX in the name mean? Good question. This card is an especially strong one, and it's called a Pokemon EX. Knowing how to use Pokemon EX cards is a shortcut to victory. Pokemon EX? Wow, I want to try! Let's get back to the battle. Zangoose, you slash! <laughs> Sprigatito's HP fell to zero! When a Pokemon's HP drops to zero, it gets knocked out. Since I knocked out Sprigatito, I'll take one prize card. When the Pokemon in the active spot is knocked out, it gets discarded along with all the attached cards. Then you'll pick another from the bench and place it in the active spot. You're good. This time, I choose Riolu. Let's go over the rules once more. The battle's only just begun. All right! I drew Lucario EX. Lucario EX can evolve from Riolu. I'm going to evolve my active Riolu. Now I'll add fighting energy to Lucario EX. Wow! Lucario EX attacks with low sweep. Zangoose has a weakness to fighting type, so it takes double the damage. 60 times two. That means 120 damage. I knocked out Zangoose. So I'll take a prize card. Pokemon EX cards have powerful attacks and high HP. On the other hand, if one gets knocked out, they give up two prize cards. I get it. Moving on. For my next turn, I think I will evolve Quaxwell into Quaquaval and use that to fight back. Well, I won't be backing down. But before that, let's go over the rules again for you. First, the rules for battles. And this is how you win. Let's resume the battle. From here on out, you'll play without my advice. It's a real match now. Okay, I just know I'm gonna win. There's no better time than now to start playing the Pokemon trading card game. 